Well, I did want to talk about concerning your training and, you know, you ran the next percent, you said you're on sponsor, but uh, a lot of people in your, now your running team, running group are starting to pick up sponsorships. We saw Drotty get picked up by Solomon, Frank Lara get picked up by Altra. Mm -hmm. And uh, so hopefully that's coming your way. But concerning uh, your new team, Roots Running, what did make you transition from Tin Man to Roots? Because that happened pretty recently and, and... yeah, just mm-hmm. wanted to hear more about that. Yeah, yeah. So I think, like like I had stated in early, like in terms of making the switch from Tin Man, it was kind of, I was looking for maybe just a bit more of a consistent um, consistent future, I guess. Like, I, you know, it, it felt like at times on Tin Man, I didn't quite know what was going to be, what was going to happen in six months, you know? And um, that that kind of, like, gives you this, like, I just don't like that uncertainty. <laughs> um, <laughs> and so, and with, uh, and with roots, I, I think that like, once I decided that I wanted a new team, I, I looked for, I kind of asked around and, um, you know, landed at Richard Hansen, Richie. Um, and he like definitely borrowed a lot from coach V Hill, who is kind of the, the godfather of distance running, but also got his start at Adam state. And so, I, you know, it was going to be a training. So system. you're loyal to your alumni. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're definitely. Old, old yeah, old. yeah. And so, you know, I, I, I figured like, oh, it's under the V Hill system. I used to train under the V Hill system. Like, cool. let's go back to, to my roots and see if that's going to help me out. And I think so far it is. We'll, we'll see how it goes for the half marathon distance and the track distances. But yeah, I'm excited. 